going on? Welcome back to your favorite camping YouTube channel, Max Your Journey. That's exactly what we're doing today. I'm sure you checked out the Cherry Stone review. And if you didn't, check it out. Hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, or hit the thumbs down. Please let me know what's going on out there. We got a huge upgrade today. Well, a couple days ago, I need you to check it out right now. Stay tuned for this episode of Max Your Journey. Let's go. All right, let's get right into it, man. Check out what we just did. Look at that, a brand new tow vehicle. As you can see, we went with the Ford. She's shining. And I didn't even clean it all the way up yet. Look at that. Ford F-150, we upgraded 2016, so pump the brakes, not brand new, but it is the 3.5 Eco Leader <laughs> Eco Boost. I'm sorry, Eco Beast, as some might say, but this thing is a beauty, man. This is exactly what we needed. 11,600 tow capacity. Let's go, man. So as you can see, the same minute we got the bed is done up already with the line x had to have that because we're gonna be throwing tons of bikes power wheels in there as you all can relate we got way too much stuff to bring with us let's look at the inside of this beauty got the cat skin seats the big screen that helps you back up man let me see if i can uh show you guys a little bit of that real quick there you go you got the big screen helps you back up and put that right on the ball of the hitch man and i'm actually actually about to tow for the first time today i got somewhere to go got a little drop off with the camper but as you can see man this beast actually averages about 18 miles per gallon um and let's take a look at this engine real quick okay so as you can see in the engine i already did a quick upgrade k and n cold air intake should be pumping out a couple more horsepower um a little bit more sound to it has the twin turbo the 3.5 as you can see and please don't underestimate these things i mean those uh 5.0 v8s those other trucks nothing on this i'm telling you this is it for the bang for the buck towing this is it 3.55 gears um like i said pumping out the torque in the horsepower i did the quick k and cold air intake upgrade i also did the short antenna just for looks looks a little better gives you a little bit more clearance if you have to go through uh like garages and stuff like that um like i said it has the cat skin leather seats and it's just plenty of room back here for all the kiddos man we got the armrest that goes up so you got six seats in here um the maxwells will be jammed in this thing and we can get some longer trips excuse a little bit of mess i had somewhere to go today but let me know what you think man uh, hey you might not be a four person let me know what you got and I'm going to let you know exactly how this toes in about a couple minutes. I'm going to be hitting the road. See how it holds the weight. We had to say goodbye to the Tahoe. But what an upgrade, man. We can put some miles behind us and memories and everything awaiting us. You know what I mean? So max your journey. Check it out. Let's see how this beast rides. All right, guys. Check this out. It even has towing. 
trailer status once I'm hooked up, trailer options, you can program different trailers you have in there, and then you have a connection checklist. Look, travel trailer, fifth wheel, goosenecks. Okay, right there, ball coupler connected and locked. It has a step-by-step -step checklist in this thing. You just keep going through, plug the pin in, lights and functions correctly. I mean, safety chains, tongue jack raised, mirrors adjusted, and then set that uh, uh, brake controller in there. Come on now. Let's check out this backup camera real quick. Cause you know what? Something's missing right now. It don't even feel right. Look, let's look at this. Hold on, backing up. Okay, you get the little beep. I'm gonna turn that off for a sec. Okay, back up, look at, look at the little dot right on there. Hold on, something still don't feel right. I can't quite put my, I know what it is. Let me stop right here, cause I gotta raise the jack. Nobody's fussing at anybody. Think about that, you and your wife. Nobody's fussing because, because you have the little dot. Man, talk about upgrades. That's what I mean, Max, in our journey. Less fussing over hooking up the camper, even backing up. Look, I'm gonna just show you this because I might not have time to show you it actually in use. But this right here actually backs it up. You've seen those little commercials. This helps guide the trailer and move the steering wheel so you can literally back up and not have to guess which way to turn or which way to turn the wheel. You start adjusting this right here and it helps back the trailer in and your brake controller. You gotta love it, man. Ford 3.5 liter EcoBoost 2016, still getting it done. Let's see how it travels once I get all hooked up and hit the road. All right, guys, I got the kiddos with me, Ace and Asher. Hi. And so far, the camper is getting towed, towed like nothing. I mean, the truck is literally just pulling this thing with ease. 1500 RPM, I'm going 50 miles per hour on this little back road so far. And I mean, it's pretty sweet. I mean, look at that. Like, I'm literally about to open it up on the highway and hit 65, 60, just to see what it's like. But I usually I cruise about 60. So I mean, so far, I love it. I absolutely love it. I got the miles per gallon set, reset. Right now I'm working my way up. So I'm about eight miles per gallon. So we'll see by the time we get there. I love it so far. Max, your journey. All right, we just got here. That was a smooth ride. 9.4 miles, but I definitely was hitting the gas if you know how I drive. So it's a little rockier. So overall, man, what a great truck we got here. And we can't wait for our next camping uh, trip to see how far and how good this truck tows on a long distance. So.